Hello viewers, I am Dr. Kalanadi, plastic and cosmetic surgeon practicing at Vicare Hospital in Ananagar and Coimbedu. Today we are going to be talking about liposuction. Liposuction for gynecomastia in particular. So gynecomastia is a condition where uh, young boys, or the school going boys, age range of about 11 to 18 who appear to have female like breasts where the breast is in excess than what is normally seen in a young adult male and this can also happen in uh, people who are above 40 but people who are above 40 care much lesser about their uh, appearance than school going children because this causes an embarrassment when they are going to play sports like swimming or any other sports which requires them to be uh, naked from uh, the waist above this is an embarrassment for the school children because uh, the peers make fun of their appearance and because of this these th uh, students avoid uh, participating in sports which require them to remove their shirts. So most parents come uh, for seeking advice about what is to be done. There are some conditions in which these are temporary where this may uh, disappear. But there are some cases where these are uh, going to be lasting longer where uh, surgery probably is advisable so that the child is more uh, free to participate in all these events. Uh, gynecomastia is a condition which is not uh, to be worried about. It is something which is treatable. So the treatment for this is in the form of liposuction. Liposuction is a procedure where a cannula with the width of about 3 millimeters, a metal cannula, is passed under the skin and above the muscle and the fat which is located in that uh, place is sucked out by connecting this uh, machine with a tube to a suction pump and the movements of the hand which goes to and fro evenly distributes the uh, removal of the fat. Though this procedure can be done under local anesthesia, because these children may be apprehensive, generally we prefer to do it under general anesthesia. Once the anesthetic is given, we inject a solution called as tumescent solution which, is, which will help to reduce the blood loss due, due to the procedure and also it will ensure that even amount of fat is uh, removed by distributing the fluid evenly across the fat tissues. This solution contains the uh, fluids which are normally given in a drip in the form of uh, Ringer's lactate and adrenaline xylocaine to reduce the pain and uh, high lace which distributes this fluid. Five to ten minutes after the tumescent solution is uh, injected, the liposuction uh, procedure is uh, started. Uh, there are two to four holes through which the liposuction uh, will be done and these holes will be of uh, about three millimeters in size so they'll be very inconspicuous. After uh, removal uh, roughly anything between 300 to 500 ml of uh, uh, liposuction will be done on each side depending upon the extent of gynecomastia and after the removal of the fluid the, uh, the holes are uh, stitched with a single stitch and a compression bandage is applied and a compression garment uh, fitting the size of this person is made ready in two to three days time and that is advised to be worn for a period of about uh, three months. Uh, this garment is to be worn as much as possible like apart from bathing time if they can wear it continuously the results tend to be better and uh, after the procedure is done the patient is discharged. Commonly the questions which are asked about uh, the liposuction for gynecomastia in particular is the cost of the treatment can uh, vary between 50,000 to 1 lakh depending upon the hospital. Some cost corporate hospitals charge uh, up to a lakh or more and uh, in uh, private nursing homes the cost can be about 50,000. And uh, the duration of stay, this is an office procedure where if the patient comes in the morning in an empty stomach for anesthetic purposes, the patient can be discharged the same day in the evening. And uh, the duration of healing, I mean like the rest which they have to take, it varies from person to person. But generally most people after three days are able to get back to school or work or whatever they are uh, doing. And uh, after the uh, patient is discharged, the patient is reviewed uh, one week later and uh, or 10 days later to remove the stitches. And uh, they are advised to wear the garments and they are reviewed monthly once for two visits. And uh, once the... Uh, uh, all this swelling and any uh, bruises uh, which may happen are healed, the patient is much happier. Thank you very much. Uh, I hope that uh, this clarifies uh, most of the doubts which you would have about liposuction. If you have any further queries, feel free to contact us at our, uh, through our e email or our mobile number or you can visit our website. Thank you very much.